Hey guys, it's Mandy from Daydream Face Painting. Today I'm going to show you this fun Gem and the Holograms look based on the new Gem movie that's coming out. So if you'd like to see how I did this, keep watching. So we're going to use three pinks for this look. Fab Fuchsia, Fab Bubblegum, and Global Neon Pink. We'll start with a 1 4 inch flat brush loaded with the Fab Fuchsia. We'll come to the center of the eye and just pull a straight line down. The flat brush works perfectly for this super angular look because it gives you that super straight edge that you need. And now I'm just going to go with the thin edge of the brush and make some guidelines as to where I'd like the stripes to head. I've used a bobby pin to pull back one side of my hair and I'm pulling the fab fuchsia all the way back into my hairline like she has in the movie. This pink washes out with one shampoo so you don't have to worry about it staining your hair. I wanted to get rid of the little bit of the curve in the line I had above my cheekbone so I'm just going in with a baby wipe and I'm straightening out the line to make it super angular. repeat the process on the other side. Same exact thing, we're just not going to take it all the way back into the hairline because the hair will be down on that side. a little bit of extra brightness, I'm sponging on some global neon pink with a Fantasy Worldwide sponge. And now to get that iridescent glitter look on her eyelids, I'm going to use some afterglow iridescent glitter just on the eyelid area. I'm just going in with a clean makeup brush and swiping away a little bit of the glitter that fell below on my cheek. I'm going to go back in with a little bit more mascara just to make my eyelashes a little bolder for that edgy rocker look. Now I've loaded up some fab bubblegum pink on a Fantasy Worldwide sponge. And I'm just going through the bottom of my hair and swiping it across to give myself some pink highlights. This is perfect for highlighting your hair because it's temporary and it washes out in one wash and it's pretty mess free. And now to finish off the look, I'm going in with some more of the Fab Fuchsia mixed with a little bit of the Global Neon Pink to give myself some lipstick. Um, if you're wearing this look for a costume, this is perfect for that because unlike lipstick, this face paint will last all night long through eating and drinking and it will not um, fade away. And that's the finished look. I hope you guys like this. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more fun face painting tutorials. Thanks for watching.